Hopefully it went live. I think it did. I haven't done this in a several months. <laughs> it's been a while. Uh, hi, hi everybody. <laughs> hi guys. Can you guys hear me okay? And let me know if you guys Okay, good. Let me know if you guys can hear the TV. If you guys can hear the TV, let me know because I would need to mute it because it's it's Disney and I don't want to, you know, get copyright. So right now Bambi is playing. Ah, oh, okay. So I'm just gonna be making right now making some bows. I do have a tutu I need to make as well. It's good, okay. You can hear okay. I might I think I'm just gonna mute it because there we go. I don't wanna get flagged for copyright. Never know, because these videos do go up after. It's just got the likes to watch Bambi. You don't hear it? Well, I mean, Archer's banging over there. <laughs> But I'm just going to mute it anyway, just in case. How's everybody doing? Is everybody doing okay? Let's see. You need to buy some of the heart bows. If I have ten more, right now I have two available. Are you talking about these ones? The shakers? Yeah, these little shaker bows. Right now I have two available. Um, it's on my Etsy. The link is in the description. Um, and I have ten more heart shakers coming in the mail, so I will have ten more. So if you want to get some before I post them, just send me a message on any of my social media accounts. Links to them are in the description. Okay. Yeah, just send me a message and I can uh, save however many you want. So right now I have two and then I'm getting ten more. And I'm probably going to order more after that. More of the shaker things. <laughs> You saw it on my Instagram? Hold on. Yeah, we're doing good, Nicole. Megan, us, me and the kids are doing good. We're doing great. The kids are doing good. Oh, you gotta go to the post office? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm probably gonna be on for about, like, an hour or two. It always ends up longer than an hour though, but yeah. So right now I'm just making some more of the bows that are going to go, the heart shakers are going to go on, on the bows, but right now I'm just making. I think Archer's banging on purpose because I talked to him before I went live and I told him that I'm going to be going live and to try to be quiet, but you guys know how kids are. And that's why he's over there banging. And now he's singing. Yes, I still do make shirts that go with the tutus. I I have a, a friend of mine um, got the Silhouette Cameo 3. She uses a Cricut, and she got the Silhouette Cameo 3 by mistake, and they told her that she could keep it. And she doesn't use the silhouette, so she asked me if I wanted it, and, and she gave it to me. So I have the silhouette um, and all the stuff that it comes with. So I'm going to start out with the silhouette and um, start making shirts from that. And then I'm also saving up for an embroidery machine as well, like a good one. 
But yeah, right now I still do make, like the shirts that I used to make, I still do make those as well. But I do want to have other options also, and not just that. Not just the iron-on. Is Gatti behind me? Hi, baby! Do you want to come say hi? Come here! She's there at the door. She sees Bambi is on, but she can't hear anything. <laughs> She's probably wondering what's going on. Thank you, Karen. Yeah, she is getting big. Come here, Katia. Do you want to come say hi? She's already two years old. I'm probably going to turn on. No, I didn't. Uh, as soon as the Steelers lost to the Browns, because I'm a Steelers fan, as soon as the Steelers lost to the Browns, no, I'm done. I'm done with football this year. I'm done. Sorry, but my Steelers lost to the Browns. I mean, the Browns were doing really good this year. But, come on, it's the Browns. My Steelers lost to the Browns, so I'm a little upset with that. So I'm like, no more football for me. Come here, let's say hi. You don't want to say hi? Bob is actually the Saints fan, so... Um, yeah. She doesn't want to say hi. She's being shy. <laughs> Look! You gonna hide down there? Bye, Nicole. Thanks for joining. You gonna be hiding, little girl? What is it? Archer, you can't have that in here. Or unless you want to turn it down. What is this, sweetie? What is it? Uh, I'm hungry. You're hungry? Do you want me to make you pizza? Yeah. Oh, you know what? Check the refrigerator. There might be something that you can heat up. I think. Oh, my pizza! Yeah, check the refrigerator. <gasps> yes, I still make fabric bows. I actually have... Do you guys remember those fabric bow sets that I used to make? I actually have all the colors. I need to make them, but I have all the colors here that I use for my fabric bow sets, so I need to get those made. I bought this a while ago, and I just had it here in the Hobby Lobby bag this whole time because I haven't had a chance to make them, but I need to make them and post them. So if you guys want fabric bow sets, I think it's 18 bows. Is it a pizza? Oh um, no. Um, um, can I have yogurt? Yes, you can have a yogurt. Yeah! Um, yeah, so I need to make them, I do make them anywhere from like 2 inches to like 6 inches. Different, um, prices. And it's 18 different colors that come in the set. For those. But I do make fabric bows and any other kind of fabric too. Oh, I didn't really pay too much attention for the Saints, but to the Saints. Um, but I'm pretty sure it was a bad year for the Saints. But the Steelers did good up until the playoffs. Sorry, I'm getting notifications. Um, let me see. The Saints have had several bad years. Actually, no. Maybe last year or the year before they did okay. Can't remember. But I know for a few years they weren't doing too good. But, yep. So what has everybody been doing? <laughs> OK, 
Okay, so I got these two. I make these pieces individually. Um, uh, I'll show you guys right now how I make them, but these are the sides of the bow. I put them on top of a, a white bow. And this is where I'm going to put the shakers on. For those that are just joining, let me get the shaker. The bow that has the shaker. I know this camera, my laptop camera sucks. But you can see the little pieces in there. If you go to like my social media, I do post pictures of these. So the pictures are better quality. But they have like the little um, conversation heart. Like you know those little conversation heart candies that you get? For Valentine's Day, that's what they have inside. It's super cute. So, where did you learn to make different? Well, when I first started, YouTube wasn't really a thing. Well, it was, but I started YouTube and I started making tutorials at at basically the same time. It was the exact same month that Linda from Mommy Crafts a lot. She did it, like, I think two weeks before me. Um, we started making tutorials the same month. And there was, like, one other channel on YouTube that was making tutorials for bows and stuff. But um, that was back in 2011. But before then, I would just use pictures from Google. And I would just Google pictures. And sometimes there was, like, websites you can go to, and it'll show you, like, the step-by-step -step on how to make certain bows. But, um, of course, over the years, I'll find different tutorials on YouTube um, of different ways to make bows and stuff. Or if I see a picture, I can just make a bow, um, based off of a picture too. Oh, Karen, thank you. Let me see. Just a little something because, oh my God, I learned how to make tutus with you the easy way. When you only had your son, thank you. And your babies are always in my prayers. Thank you so much, Karen. That's so sweet. I love making, and I remember when I first started making tutorials, my dad told me that it's going to destroy my business and I remember telling him because I was making tutorials when I was still living with my parents and I remember um can I have another one yes you can go oh can I have another one I can have only two though don't have any more than that okay oh you have to save some for your sister um and I remember telling him I remember saying if you watched one of my tutorials would you be able to make a bow and he was like probably not and I'm like well you know some people can do it and some people can't and that's why there's still people out there that will buy bows and even me I make bows and I still buy bows from other people also because sometimes other people have really cute bows and I'm like I want that bow so I'm gonna buy it or a tutu or whatever um so just because you make them doesn't mean you know you won't buy them you know and I like teaching others because I got so many questions on how I made them so I just decided to make videos uh hi from the Ukraine sorry I can't I don't know how to say your name <laughs> you're cleaning you're cleaning on top of everything else you're cleaning right now <laughs> you've been cleaning your carpet Maggie says she's been cleaning her carpet yeah, I have to vacuum in my room. I already vacuumed the dining room and the hallway. I need to get everything cleaned up in the living room and vacuum in the living room. And then I do need to vacuum in my room as well. But I have stuff. I have a, a tutu back there. Oh, right there. That I need to box up. And there's one in a box down there. I don't know if you see it. There's a box down there. I have a tutu in there as well. A Valentine's Day tutu. And then, of course, that's the pastel, pastel rainbow one that I made. I need to get those shipped off. Anai is no longer with us. She passed away two years ago. The baby that you see behind me, that's my youngest. That's Gathia. Yeah. She's two. And Anai is actually turning six years old this year, in April. If she was still here, she would be six. Six years old. I think that is crazy. I wonder what she would have been like. That's one thing I wonder about all the time. So, we went to go see her today, also. We went to go visit her, because we were driving by, and usually when I drive by, I always try to go that way, and sometimes we just drive by and say hi, or we actually stop and say hi, so. Yep. 
But this little one that's right here. Oh, I'm so sorry, BB. This is Katya. She's my two-year-old. She's baby number three. Right, BB? I just elbowed her in the face. <laughs> I'm sorry, BB. You want to say <laughs> Do you want to come say hi? Can I hold you? You want to come say hi? Or are you going to be shy? It's okay. Thank you, Sleepy Mountain. You stink. Do you need a diaper change? <laughs> Do you need a diaper change? Ow, baby, don't hit me in the face. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm okay. This is my wild and crazy two-year-old. And she looks exactly like me. Right, baby? My baby pictures and hers are almost identical. Yeah, she was doing great with all her therapy. It was a lot. But she was doing awesome. Don't do that. No, 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 no. That's gross. Don't do that. Okay, do you want to get down? So these are the white bows that I'm putting these on. Oh, right now, I don't know if you guys saw, but I just glued them together like this. Sorry, I cannot, I don't know where the, the camera's right there, Cheryl. Right there. Look at the camera. So yeah, I just glued them together. And I'm going to glue it on top of this bow. I didn't want to just make like any kind of bow to put these shakers on. I wanted it to look different and cute. So I just glued it on top. And then I'm going to put this ribbon around it, around the center. Oh, your name is Sarah? Okay. <laughs> that way I can put a name to the, to the account. Oh, you can see it. Okay. I know the quality of the webcam is no fun. I got this camera a few months ago. I need to put everything back in it. This is my vlogging camera. I want to taste this one. Can I? No, sorry. I already told you only two. Go put it back, please. But I want to taste it. You can taste it tomorrow when I when I let you have another one. Okay? You can't eat the whole box. Is there? Get one of your lunchables. Do you want the fruit that's in there? Okay. If you eat your dinner, I'll let you have one more tonight. Okay, but you need to put it back right now. Thank you. But yeah, I got this one. The Canon G7X Mark II. So, one with the flip up camera. I got it. At the, actually, a year ago. I got it a year ago. How is how is Archer now? Uh, how old is Archer now, or how is he doing? Is that what you're asking? He's actually seven years old, and he's crazy, <laughs> but he's he's doing really good. He could be a handful at times, but he's very strong-willed. <clears throat> Which is a good thing in a way. It's just difficult sometimes when you're trying to get him to do things and he likes to reason, but he's awesome. Yeah, he's seven. What sewing machine do I recommend? The one that I have is the Brother... It's like an embroidery and sewing machine, which I'm actually going to get another one. Um, it's the SE400. And, um, yeah, the Brother... SE 400. I've had this one for almost 10 years now. I've had it for almost 10 years. And then the one I had before this one was my mom's old sewing machine that she had when she was younger. So it was from like, I think like the 80s or the 90s or something like that. Probably from the 80s, I guess. Um, or maybe before. I don't know. I don't remember. But, yep. 
and I've had two other sewing machines, but one of them was Bob's, and then the other one I sold to a friend. So, yeah, yeah, Archer is very, I'm not saying it's like, he's not bad or anything, he's just very opinionated, he's very strong-willed, he's very, um, stubborn, and it's not a bad thing, because, you know, we need people like that in this world, but sometimes when it comes to trying to parent that child, it can be a little difficult and stressful. <laughs> But he is very sweet. Like, he absolutely loves his sisters. Like, he's very kind and very sweet. He's not a mean a mean person. He's not a mean kid. Um, of course, they fight like siblings do, but he's not, like, he won't go and pick on anybody or anything like that. He's very, very sweet and loving. And he cares a lot, so... <laughs> Do you use the gathering attachment to help with the gathering of your tutus? No, I just um, I just sew a straight line, just simple. And then um, when I put it on the waistband, that's when I just like have it, if that's what you mean. Where do you most often get your tool and ribbon? Um, right now. It's just mostly like Hobby Lobby, Walmart, and Michaels and stuff. Um, I don't have a website because Gifts International has – it's not the best place to get the stuff anymore because their shipping is outrageous. They're, they take forever to ship it, and they also – the shipping price is expensive. And there's other ones that I uh, have heard about, but I haven't ordered from them yet, so I don't really have an opinion on them. I can't even remember. I have it saved somewhere. The websites um, but once they start ordering in bulk again then I will let you guys know where I get them from why do you do that with the oh with the fire oh I'm heat sealing <clears throat> the ends of the tool like if you or sorry not the tool the ribbon just so that the ribbon doesn't unravel because sometimes the end it it can uh, start to like the fabric will unravel so you use the lighter and you heat seal it so that way it doesn't unravel. So that's what I was doing. But I'm just lining an alligator clip right now to put on the back of this tutu of this. Why do I keep saying tutu? On this bow. Got this watching Bambi behind me. Is that your favorite part? The part when he's on the ice? is Katya's favorite part. She can't hear it right now, so she's probably... Oh, <laughs> she's saying... <laughs> oh, okay, that's what you meant? Okay. Let's see here. <laughs> Okay, so I got another one done. These usually, usually don't take me too long to make. Um, but, so, for these, I cut two, this is 1.5 inches wide ribbon. I cut two strips that are 18 centimeters long, which is about 8 inches. Um, I usually use inches, but... And then for the pink bow on the top, I cut 15 centimeters, which is almost 6 inches. So I guess it's basically like 6 inches. So I cut 2 for the bow on the top, and then you heat seal it. I think I already did this side, yeah. Okay, and then you fold the ends with the 
pretty side facing up here. Hold on, let me see if I could show you guys how it's folded. It's just folded like this, where you just take it and you fold one end down, and then the other end down. Like that. And then, and this this right here is the pretty side of the ribbon. And then on the side that I just showed you, you're going to fold one piece up to the point, and then the other piece up to the point like that, so that way the back looks like this, and then the front looks like that. And then you just stitch along here. And you pull it tight. So where's my? Do I make a lot of tutus? I used to make a lot of tutus, but I haven't really been doing it for the past two years. Um, I'm barely getting back into it. And then when you get to this part, the point here. You make sure you stitch to hold this point down. And then you just pull the ribbon tight. So that way it looks like that. And then I just stitch back and forth, like up and down through here a few times, and then tie it off. Now use a Nerf gun. Mom? Yes. I love you. I love you too, baby. What are you doing? I don't know. Oh, this is not... <sighs> what? 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 Hey, calm down, sweetie. To what? What to the red? Wait, let's see if I should. No, 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 no. Take that away. Take that away from here. Well, I actually want red. Oh, he's talking about the sound. There's a sound bar here on the program that's open to go live. So then it ends up looking like this, and I just stitch right there. And that's one side. And then you just do the same thing to the other one. Oops. Yes? Can you give me the Play-Doh that's the box? In the laundry room? On top of the dryer? Yeah, I already have no, not the no. It's in the yellow bucket. Yeah, that's what I see. Then can you get it? Yellow bucket. Yeah, the one that you make the face on. This. Yeah, there's play one there. Sit at the table. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to hear about your grandma. And then I need to thread my needle. And then I just use a clip to hold it. <laughs> if I forget to thread the needle. Has anybody made anything? Or what are your plans for Valentine's Day? Like, for other people out there that make stuff, what do you guys make? If you make and sell stuff. Because this is what I'm doing basically for Valentine's Day. Is mostly these bows.
or if you guys do make stuff, what do you make? Oh, it's 9 a.m. where you're at? <laughs> I actually want some coffee right now, too. And I was just out. Um, I was out running a few errands, and I didn't even think to stop to get a coffee. I normally do. I go to Dunkin'. Dunkin's my favorite. Oh, you're in Australia? Awesome. I have a lot of friends. I have a few friends. Not a lot. A few friends in Australia. Skirts and shirts. Did you figure out your new machine? Oh, the silhouette. I still here. I haven't done anything with it yet. Um, I still need to order some vinyl and stuff. I know some people have commented of a few places to get it at. Um, but um, I got some vinyl already just to like play around with to see. But I do want to order some vinyl. Oh, you make bracelets? That's awesome. I used to make bra bracelets a long time ago. Especially when I was a kid, I used to make bracelets a lot. April says, I've been away from my sewing machine for a little. I'm trying to work my way back into it. I don't usually sew for Valentine's unless I'm asked. You should get back into it. I love sewing. Before the pandemic, I made custom clothes, aprons, anything for babies, pretty much anything, even cosplay. Oh, that's awesome. You get mine from, you get yours from Michael's? I haven't, I mean, I saw them at Michael's when I, I don't go to Michael's too often. Um, cause it is kind of expensive, but I have seen it at Michael's. I know I got some at Hobby Lobby and they were 40% off. So I grabbed just one black and one white, the vinyl for like the shirts and stuff. Um, so I'm just going to use that just to like, kind of like play around with and test stuff out. So, I mean, I, I'll take any advice, tips and tricks and anything like that. I've been watching YouTube videos as well. Um, but I don't know, I just have a lot of anxiety when it comes to new gadgets, and I'm sure most people do. But yeah, so I have the silhouette, I'm going to start using the silhouette, and whatever I make from the silhouette, um, I'm going to be saving up for an embroidery machine. There's a specific embroidery machine that I was recommended to get, so got to save up for it. It's quite expensive. Hi! Is it first call design and craft? What's your name? Oh, hey, Danny. <laughs> yeah, Danny was the one that I was talking to about the embroidery machine. So she's the sweet threads, sweet threads gifts. If you guys don't follow her on YouTube, go ahead and follow her because she makes awesome videos, especially about embroidery and stuff like that. I absolutely love her videos. She's a good friend of mine. Yes, yes, Danny. I know. Oh, I'm so nervous, but I really, I've been for years, for years, even before Archer was born, I have been wanting to do embroidery and like, I have a lot of anxiety. So I just never, I just never, I mean, this sewing machine that I have, this sewing machine that I have, my parents got it for me because it's embroidery and sewing. I mean, it doesn't do a lot of embroidery. It does, like, mostly little things. I'm not even sure what size the, the, I can't even think of the name of it right now. The thing that you put it on. But uh, I'm not sure what size, because I have all the stuff stored away. But I never even used the embroidery part. My parents bought it for me specifically because it has embroidery and sewing. But I never out of the almost 10 years that I've had it, I've never done the embroidery part. 
I have an embroidery machine, but would like to know how I can resize my pattern. Oh. Yeah, you would uh, go, like, Danny uh, from Sweet Threads Gifts, she can give you a lot of advice. Also, um, Sterling Styles, Pam from Sterling Styles. Also, if you, you can contact either of them. Or even Angela from, um, oh, what's her YouTube channel name? I gotta look it up. Because I can't think of it off the top of my head. Angela Jasmina, I think that's how you say it's this one. It's her. I don't know if you guys can see that. But yeah, she has a lot of great videos on her channel as well. Danny also, subscribe to Jan Danny too, Sweet Threads Gifts and uh, Sterling Styles as well. All three of them have great advice. They all can help you. Pam. <laughs> Pam from Sterling Styles. The hoop. Wait, hold on. Yes, everybody loves Danny. She's amazing. <laughs> yeah, follow all three of them. Subscribe to all three of their channels. Yeah, go to Danny's YouTube channel. She check out her videos. Like I watched, like like I said, I've I've watched uh, Pam's videos for years. I've been friends with her for a long time. I've watched her videos for years. Um, trying to get into embroidery, but like I said, my anxiety does not let me. Uh, I should not be blaming my anxiety, but I would try to get started, and I'm like, no. And that's why when I when I opened up the because I had this silhouette machine for almost a year, and I'm like I need to get it open, I need to open this thing up. So I decided just to do it. Don't don't think about it, just do it. So I have it all set up now, but I haven't done anything with it yet. I need to. My goal is to actually get something done this week with it. Everything's set up on the computer and everything. No, Danny, uh, her channel name is Sweet Threads Gifts. She's here in the chat. She's chatting. Oh, sweet gifts. Oh, yes, with sweet threads gifts. Um, but she makes such amazing stuff. <laughs> yeah, she's right here. She's here. <laughs> yeah, I. Yeah, I do a lot of sewing of baby stuff as well, babies and, and young girls. Um, once it starts getting into the bigger girls and adults, I don't do too much. It just depends on my mood. Um, but yeah, I have done adult tutus, and I have done older girls, like teenagers and stuff. I have done tutus for them as well. But usually, I like to stick around to like the size 6 and under. Um, very rarely do I do size 8 or 10 or anything bigger than that. Um, like I said, it just depends on my mood for tutus. Bows, like, of course, it's just one size fits all, you know. If an adult wants to buy my bows for themselves, that's fine. There was one, um, order I did years ago for a dad. He had ordered a tutu because his daughter was having a a tutu and tea party. I think she was like six or seven years old, but she was having a, a tutu and tea party birthday party. And her mom had passed away, uh, shortly after she was born. So her dad was, has been raising her, um, by himself. So he not only ordered a tutu for her, but he ordered a tutu for himself as well, which I thought that was the cutest thing. I thought it was so sweet. So I made him a tutu that matched his daughter's tutu, and I thought it was super cute. I'm like, that's a real dad right there. That's awesome. Okay, I thought she had something she wasn't supposed to have. Yeah, it was super cute. I thought it was adorable. 
but oh yeah I, I wanted to get into quilting as well um, I have a, a friend that does here where I live that does quilting and she says that it's very tedious and it does take a lot of time it's um, a lot of work so I was like oh, on top of tutus and stuff which already take a long time to do I decided just not to get into it but quilting I think is pretty awesome it's just like I said it's just probably like a lot of work so but I think quilts are amazing I think they're awesome but I still have to make that rose petal tutu. I got these rose petals. Um, this is like a pack of 500. And it was like $3 or $4. Yeah, I mean, if I do quilting, I probably won't do it to actually sell. I might make a quilt probably for myself or family or a friend or something like that, maybe as like a gift, but I don't know if i do it as a business because if tutus already take forever to make, I'm pretty sure quilting is going to take up all my time as well. Well, the tutus that I do take forever to make, like the one that's back there, the ones with the, the circles, that one takes a while. I'm a lot faster at it than I used to be. Gonna check to see. <laughs> Does anybody else make anything that's interesting? That's fun. What was I? Oh, this. Let me get back to sewing these bows. I'm probably gonna make that tutu that the rose petals need to go on. Because I need to make the tutu first and then I can start sewing it, but I need to get all the colors. Because the colors are turquoise, hot pink, yellow, um, purple, lime green, and white. Not too much white though, just a little bit of white. Oh, well, thank you. Hi, Camila. Camilla. Yes, this is my daughter right here. This is Katia. I'm so glad I was able... <laughs> That's awesome, Danny. <laughs> I and, and that's another thing. When I first started making tutorials and my dad had told me that it's going to... Because I had my business before. I was, I was actually on eBay and then I had just started like Etsy at that time as well. It's back in like 2000... I started eBay like in 2008... And then I think it was in 2010, I started Etsy, maybe, or 2009, 2009 or 2010, but um, then I started making tutorials because I would get a lot of questions on how I made them. Hi, Karen. And um, and I, I, and I remember my dad, like I said before, telling me that it's going to destroy my business, but it didn't. It actually boosted it because I would get messages, and I still get messages like this today, where people are like, "I give up. Can you just make it for me?" You know, because they try. I mean, people, you can do it or you can't. Like, you know, some people probably can do it, but they don't have the time to do it. You know, so or they try and they try and they try and they just they just give up because it's just too stressful. Because honestly, the first time you do things, it is hard. It is hard, and you're gonna mess up, and you you know you're gonna make mistakes, but that's why you just got to keep practicing. So, like, trust me, my bows and everything, when I first started, like I said, I wish I still had pictures. Um, I might actually... Katya, get off of that! Hey! Uh-uh, Katya, no. Um, I wish I still had the pictures of my first bows. They might still be on my eBay if it's still active. I don't know if they delete if eBay deletes your account, if it hasn't been active for a while. I don't know. Or if you haven't logged in for a while. Apparently they did that to my other Etsy account. I had closed it. 
um, after Anai had passed away. And then just a few months ago, back in November, when I went to go try to open it again, it says this account has been permanently closed. And I'm like, but why? Maybe it's because I haven't used it for two years. I'm not sure how Etsy works. So I had to create another Etsy account, start all over again. So the Etsy account that I have now is my new one. Oh, and the other one I had for a few years. But I don't know. I think Etsy might... If you're not active on it for a while, I don't know. I really don't know what happened. I can't even log into it or anything. Hold on. I made my flower girl tutu when I got married for the first time. They do take a while, but well worth the time. You do a beautiful job on yours. Oh, thank you, April. My goal is to do embroidery and more resin items. Oh, that sounds fun. Thank you, Karen. Oh, yeah, yeah. The first the first few times that you make anything, I think that's why a lot of people give up. Because, like, they try and... They try and then they just stop. Aw, thank you, Anna. I'm glad I was able to help. Oh, <laughs> yeah, the fabric rolls are, are so quick and easy to make, but you can't, like, if you want to just make one bow, you can't just buy, like, I mean, fabric's not that cheap. Here, Katia. Here, did you want this or not? No. No? Okay. Do I need to change your diaper? You say no to everything. She's already at the no stage. Start posting. Just start posting on there, April. That's awesome. And message me and let me know what your Etsy and your Facebook um, pages are so I can follow them. Yeah... Yeah, I think that's a lot of people. Like, don't, like, honestly, when I first started, I wasn't really doing it. I mean, it's okay to do it as, like, trying to be successful with it. But starting out, like, my advice would just, just be just do it for fun. Um, because you don't want to, you really don't want to um, disappoint yourself, I guess you could say, in a way. Just, um... That's how I started out, basically, was just doing it for fun. Like, I was making bows for my friend's little girls that I used to take care of. And um, then I just started selling them. But another advice would be, like, if you want to su succeed, just keep pushing. Even if you're not selling, just keep pushing. It is hard. It is stressful. It sucks. But just keep going. Just keep going because your day will come. Like, don't give up. Because once you give up, then you won't be successful. So yeah, it took me three years to sell anything, any of my bows on eBay. Like, I would sell one or two a year. And finally, after three years, they started selling. Finally, after three years. But that was back in 2008 when I first started. But it's a lot faster now. Like, social media has grown so much since then, so it's a lot faster to sell things now than it was back then. But I think you'll do awesome. You just gotta keep pushing. Yeah, like, if you, if you just, like, another thing is also, like, word of mouth, too. Um, I used to do a lot of giveaways. So that way people can, like, physically see my stuff and try them out and, you know, stuff like that. And then they'll recommend it to other people. And then, you know, I used to do a lot of giveaways. I used to do weekly giveaways on my Facebook. 
every week I do a giveaway. And it wasn't just one bow. Like, I used to give away, like, 20, 30 bows. Crazy girl. Hey. <laughs> Go get your juice. Katya. No. Okay, well then put it go, go put it in the trash. Go put it in the trash. Put it in the trash. No. Yes, baby, go put it in the trash. No. No. Do you want to put it in this trash? Put it in the trash. There you go. Go get some wipes. Or go wash your hands. Hold on, guys. Let me get the water started for it. Where's your, where's your cup? What? Yeah, just open it up and post a few things. And honestly, with Etsy, if you're going to start out, it's always best to have um, social media to share it on as well, not just rely on Etsy to share your stuff. Um, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. You just have to have like an Instagram as well, post it on Instagram, post, make a Facebook page, post it on Facebook, uh, make a TikTok, post them on TikTok. Just try different social media accounts because um, it'll drive in traffic as well. It helps a lot. I have a specialty sewing nursing covers. Thank you for the encouragement. I will get you the link. I have to look up my Etsy one since it's not active. Okay, yeah, just just message me and and uh, or show me pictures and you know stuff like that. I can always help you out as well. And same with um, Danny. Uh, she does Etsy as well too. So if you have any questions, you can always ask her as well. And there's a lot of um. Etsy groups on Facebook that you can also join and you can get advice from. Just think that they're so cute. I've sold almost 50 of these. I've sold about 50 of them. And I'm getting 10 more. Like, no. I sold about 40. I'm getting 10 more, so that make, that would make 50. So, yeah, I've ordered. I ordered them in, like, sets of 10. Which I should just order more, but I didn't think that they were going to sell as fast as they're selling. So, which is why I keep ordering them in just sets of tanks. I don't want to have too many left over. Oh, you have to go to work? Bye. Thank you so much for joining us. Have a good day. Yeah, like, I had other, I think, let me see if I could find it. I had red bows. Those sold out super fast. And then when I went to go order more of the the red heart shakers, they were sold out. And I cannot find them anywhere else. Um, these ones are not, like, I, may, I was able to find them. Um, but let me find the other one. Do I still have... Yes, I do. Okay, good. Because I also made unicorn horns with... Because they had, um... 
the ones that you can use to make bows with. Here's this one. I haven't put this one on a horn yet, but it's not with the... This back here is a different material. But here, it's like a bow, and it has the shakers in it, or the confetti. So it comes in like a, a rectangle sheet thing, and you just fold it to make a bow. I don't know if you guys can see that. But... So I made, these are on my Etsy as well. I have three of these and one of these left. So I made a gold one with the red. And this one has like little love letters and little red hearts. But these bows that I made sold out super fast because they're really cute. So... Yes, okay. Yeah, I think tomorrow or Thursday. What day is today? Tuesday? Yeah, tomorrow or Thursday is when I should be getting the other more of these parts in. And then I'll be able to make 10 more bows. I'm trying to get done with these bows so that way when they come in, just put the heart shakers on them and they'll be ready to go. And Bambi's over. Bambi's over. It's done. Yes, guys. <laughs> Hold on. Let me see something here. Danny, would you want to be a moderator? I can make you a moderator. Yeah, right now I'm at 18 thumbs up. 18 likes on this video. And right now it says current viewers is 21. <laughs> and I am going to be making a tutorial on the rose petal tutu that I made because I know I got a few questions about that one. It's, it's really simple. Another really tedious tutu to make. Very tedious, but I think it'd be perfect for like flower girl dresses, um, Valentine's Day tutus, fairy tutus. I think it'd be super cute to make tutus with the rose petals at the bottom um, as like little fairy tutus and stuff. I think that'd be really cute. Thank you, Anna. My, um, okay, Danny, I made you moderator. Yeah, 25, I see that. That's awesome. Um, let's see here. I was watching some of your old videos yesterday from, oh, yeah. I mean, I still have the, my, my channel used to be just that about. I do still do tutorials, um, every now and then. I just don't have very many ideas. But whenever I do, I always do. I always make a tutorial. Or if somebody has a question on something, I will make a tutorial on it. Um, 
but I probably would just start making videos now of me just like crafting and, and some of my day and stuff like that, but mostly like crafting and stuff because, yeah. Uh, hold on, somebody had another question here. Anna said, would you say your business gives enough profit to support yourself or better doing it as a side hustle only? It was. Uh, before Anae passed away, I was making anywhere from like three to $5,000 a month. Um, taxes are horrible though. <laughs> um, that's the only thing that I hated the most was taxes. Because not only do I have to pay taxes for my business, but I pay taxes for YouTube as well, for my YouTube income. Um, but yeah, so I am, for me personally, I do make I am able to live off of it. Um, do you have a sister or brother? I have four sisters and two brothers. I always have to think about that because I wasn't raised with all of them. I have one sister in Florida. My, my half sister in Florida. We have the same mom, different. No, we have the same dad, different moms. Another half sister in California. Uh, we have the same mom and different dads, and then one of my brothers, we have the same mom and dad, and then the other brother and two sisters I was raised with, like, I was adopted, so they were my siblings growing up. No, I don't have a cat. I'm more of a dog person. I mean, I love cats, but I don't know if I would ever own one, because, I don't know. I never really had a cat before, so I wouldn't really know what too much of what to do. I'm more of a dog person. I mean, I love cats, but I don't think I would own one. Hey, no, 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 baby. You have to squeeze it. Yeah. You have to squeeze it. You want me to help you? Come here. Come here. Look, I'll show you. You used to eat these all the time. Did you forget how to eat them? Come here. You have to squeeze it. Look. <laughs> yeah, I love dogs. I am more of a big dog person. Not so much of a small dog person. I like big dogs or medium sized dogs. But what's your favorite movie or movies? I have anything Disney, anything Disney. I'm a fan of Harry Potter. I'm a fan of, uh, can't think off the top of my head of anything else. Huh. Yeah. Like right now we're, we're doing a Harry Potter marathon. So, um, we, We watch one of the Harry Potter movies every night at bedtime. We always try to... Right, like at bedtime, I always put on one of the Harry Potter movies. At least once a month, we'll go like a whole week of watching like a Harry Potter movie every day. At least once a month. Or once every two months. Uh, we no longer, or I no longer have the dogs. Back in 2018, it was the beginning of the year. Ana was in the hospital for like six weeks. And um, my ex got rid of them. So, yeah, I miss them. The quarantine themed bows. Oh, I'm so glad. The hold on. I still have some. Let me show you guys. I still have some of the quarantine themed bows. Um. Oh, if like if anybody wants any, I still have one, two, three, four sets. No, five sets. I still have five sets. Here, let me let me show you. I think it's these. I think these are what you're talking about. This one is the Purell. Hold up. I can't see myself. 
So yeah, this is the Purell one, the hand sanitizer. And then this is the toilet paper one, the Charmin, because you guys remember when everybody bought all the toilet paper? For I don't know what reason. And then this is the Lysol spray. So yeah, this was my quarantine pandemic. I think these are the ones you're talking about. Um, yeah, I still have five sets of these available. I don't want to put them on Etsy because I think they're probably copyright. Because um, I'm trying to avoid putting copyright, anything copyright on Etsy. So yeah. But they are, how many inches are they? Four and a half inches wide. And they're on alligator clips. Yes, Fox Panda. Yeah, I have, uh, I had three kids. One of my daughters is right there. My youngest one. Yeah, I miss them. I do want to get another dog. Archer's been begging me for a dog. But I don't like having dogs in apartments. Because uh, I live in an apartment. Um, I like I like to have my own house to where they can have like their own space. So we can actually go outside and like play outside with them. Um, and let them just run. Um, when I do have dogs, they're normally inside dogs. But... Dogs, you know, need space to run and play, too. We do have a dog park, but I like to have a backyard for them. Will you talk about how you take photos of your items? Yes. I am um, saving up for, like, a box light or whatever those things are called. But right yeah. now, I... If Gafia does not... Yeah. Are you dead? Yeah. Okay. Go wash your hands again, please. Right now I just use a ring light. Uh, you can see it right there. Oh, I can't. Okay, I can't. There. Right there. That's my ring light. I have two of them. I have one sitting right here as well. Um, and uh, I use... Sometimes I use these. I don't like to use these. I used to use these a lot. This is like the scrapbooking paper from Hobby Lobby. I usually get something like this, or maybe something that's just like white, but I like the, the look of the wood. Um, I usually get these to take pictures of my bows on. I have this as well, that I take pictures of like shirts and bows and tutus and stuff like that on. Sorry. Okay. This is from Hobby Lobby as well. I just put it on a poster board, or like a cardboard, big piece of cardboard. And then I also just got this because I want to take pictures of my tutus with it as a background instead of just outside. Both of you need to put those back, please. You said she, I'm going to see them? But she hasn't had one. Yeah. Remember, you got two already, so this is her second one. Go put it back until after dinner. You want pizza for dinner, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay, you need to if listen. I finish it, I'll you, get the next yogurt. Yes, when you finish all your pizza, I'll let you have another yogurt. This kid. This kid. <laughs> oh, where was I? Oh, and then this here. If I can reach it. This is what Gathi was standing on. But I got this at Hobby Lobby as well. I do want to get, um, they're kind of expensive though, but I do want to get like the photo backdrops to take pictures of my tutus with. But I got this and it's wood themed or it's like wood as well. I don't know if you guys can see, but it's wood. And it's just like a long poster board. Not poster board. Like those things that you use for like the bulletin boards. Yeah, it's bulletin board paper. So I'm going to put this up on my wall or something and then use my ring light to take pictures of my tutus. Because sometimes I finish a tutu at 3 in the morning and I want to take a picture already and have to wait till daylight. Uh, hold on guys, I'm sorry. Oh, you've been checking out my Etsy. I saw it and post everything. Elizabeth, like, I have millions. I feel like it's millions. If you guys see my wall, I know I showed it in some of my videos, and I have some pictures on my social media, but my wall, all my walls in this room are covered with bows that I need to post on my Etsy. I have so many bows. So if you want to see what I have before I post them on Etsy, just send me a message, and I will take pictures of everything, and I'll show you what I have. Um, I still didn't even post up all my tutus that I have also. I have another probably 30 different types of tutus that I'm going to post on my Etsy also. Oh, hold on. I'm trying to read here. 
But yeah, Elizabeth Garland, she said, I've been checking out your Etsy girl. Just need my paycheck. <laughs> uh, do I hate coronavirus? Yes. It's a pain. I have I have not had it. Knock on wood. But um yeah. I have a lot of friends who've had it. Where do you buy your tool? Buy the bolt in bulk. What about your ribbon? I'm starting to make tutus and the ribbon cost is too. Yeah, right now, since I don't have very many tutu orders, I haven't been buying ribbon and to tool in bulk. I used to do Gifts International, but like I said before, it's um, their shipping prices are outrageous and, um, their, uh, their shipping time takes forever. I think my roommate's here. He got home from work. Um, let's see. The Charmin ones are the bottom. <laughs> That's funny. Sorry, I'm trying to catch up with comments here. We had a cockapoo game away because we didn't have a car or real room for him to play. We really miss him. Yeah, see, that's why I don't like having dogs in an apartment. I mean, at least big dogs. I mean, if it was a small dog, not a big deal, but a big dog, I feel like they don't have any space. They just lay around. They can't really do anything. You don't want them running around in your house either. Uh, You're my favorite YouTuber. Oh, thank you. Yes, I do stay home as much as possible. Yeah, I'm going to tack it up on the wall with push pins. Uh, Danny. Yes, Anae. Elizabeth said, I miss her. Seeing the other two makes me miss Little Warrior. Yeah, I miss Warrior. Yeah, our Little Warrior. I miss her too. I, I went to go see her today. I might do that for now. Make a light box. There you go, light box. What did I say before? Did I say light box? Um, Because that one I got, the one I want is pretty expensive. But I have seen videos on how to make them, so I think I might actually just make one for now until I can save up for the other one. Lily uh, Guzman, Guzman, Guzman. She said, "Can you give me a shout out?" Yes. Hi, Lily. Hold on. Give me one minute, guys. Oh, okay. It's having a, like a service dog? You're not at home enough? Fox Panda Gamer, yes. Hi. I use interface for the diffuser. I hope it works. Oh, okay. That's, that's pretty smart. Yeah, tool off the bolt. I only use tool off the bolt for the one, like the, not the ribbon trim tutus, not like the one that's back there behind me, wherever, pointing. Um, I use those, the spool for those, but I don't use the tool off the bolt for like regular tutus. It's a pain to cut. Takes a while. Oh, thank you, Lily. So I need to put a clip on this one. Did you finish? Yeah. Okay, go put it in the trash. And that's the last one. There's no more. Go put it. Go put it in the trash. I'm not gonna throw it away for you. Go put it in the trash. Go put it in the trash. Kathy, Rebecca, go put it in the trash. Are you going to come put it in my trash? Right here? Put it in the trash can. Thank you. You going to go wash your hands? Mm -hmm. 
Uh, yes, let's go wash your- No! No! Come on, let's go wash your hands. No, I don't want you touching my stuff with your sticky hands. Come on, let's go wash your hands. Come on, let's go, let's go. One, two, three, go. I'm gonna carry you. And then you're gonna get upset. Uh, you are just like your brother. Okay, hold on, guys. Hold on, hold on. Hi. Oh, hi. tool with the glitter? Yeah, no. Hi. Nope, nope. She's saying hi. 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 Yeah, tool with glitter? Mm-mm. I don't like using that. Nope, that's the worst. You end up having glitter all over your house for years. Oh, the only... They only had the colors of the tool and glitter. Yeah, it's a mess. Oh dear lord, you scared me. Whoo! What'd you make? That's cute. How did you make that? Well, you know. Yes, I don't like using glitter. Yay, I have 30 likes. 30? Yeah, see, look, 30. 30 likes. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Got the uh, angels inside. Oh, you made it with that? That is cool. Why you took out the hands in the lid? Oh. Ah. Uh, 31 likes. Okay, so hopefully once I start making shirts with my silhouette, um, if you guys have any ideas, um, let me know on like ideas of what kind of shirts you guys would like. Uh, I have a lot of ideas and I'll be posting them on my Etsy as soon as I start making them, make little samples. I have a lot of fun ideas. There is one. I don't know if I want to say it right now because I want to make it first and then you all can use that idea. But right now, uh, there is an idea I want to do for the uh, for the year 2020 since it was such a painful year. But I think it'd be a funny a funny shirt 
to look back on. Yeah, there's there's still times that I like there's certain things that I'll open, like a lot of my craft drawers I'll open and I'll be like, oh my gosh, this is full of glitter. Or like fabric that I that I have in there. It's just still full of glitter. Because I still have a lot of fabric and ribbon that I've had for years. Um and I'll open it up and it's like full of glitter from a tutu that I probably made like five years ago. Um, I, I haven't opened up another website on anything else right now. I am actually thinking about using, oh, what is it called? Jeez, I can't think of the name. It's not Amazon. It's not Wix. I think it's the other one. There's one, I can't remember what it's called, that I want to start using as well. But I want to get like my business up and running again on Etsy. I'm so mad that I had to start all over again. I really don't know. I think, let me know if this is true or not. I don't know. I haven't gotten in touch with Etsy about it, but my other Etsy account that I've had for years, um, I wasn't using it. I had like closed my shop. I didn't deactivate or delete or anything like that. I just closed my shop after NIA passed away. And I went to open it up again and it says that my shop is no longer available or something like that. I don't know if they deleted it or... Or what had happened. I don't know. But I was a little upset. Because I had all my reviews on there. I had all my previous sales on there. So I had to open up a whole new Etsy shop. But I'm pretty sure if you go to YouTube. I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos. On other sites to use. Besides Etsy. Like other things to use. So I'm pretty sure there might be a video out there. Comparing Etsy and Squarespace. I'm actually thinking of I might post a few things on eBay again too, just so that I have another one. But we'll see. I'll play it by ear. eBay was the first one I ever opened. Yeah. Is it good? Juice. Yeah. <laughs> I wish I could just like pick up my. Did we get it from you? Thank you. These were the cups that I got them for Halloween. If you click the button, hers. I think the battery on hers died or something, but they're supposed to light up. Oh wow, you have to like hold the button now. That's a pain. Whoa. But I've had it since they've had it since Halloween, so. But isn't that so cool? Archer has an orange one. But hers is just pink with a little skull on it. So yeah. It's cute. Yeah, it probably did, because like I said, it was like two years that it was um inactive, so they probably just assumed that I didn't want to. I don't know. I, but they probably did deactivate it uh, due to that. You shop a lot on Poshmark. I have to look that up. Oh, because you're a huge makeup. <laughs> That's weird. I don't know. I wonder why. I wonder why mine says it's no longer available. Unless maybe I did delete it. I could have sworn I had just like closed my shop, put it like on vacation mode. But maybe, I don't know. I really don't remember. I was going through a really rough time, obviously, at that time. So I honestly do not remember. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Right, Angel. So yeah, I was a little upset. I'm like, I had that shop for several years and I had a lot of reviews and a lot of sales. So it sucks to have to start all over again, but that's okay. That's okay. When you, if you're going to start something, just, just go, just do it. Just do it.
I was also making these too. The faux hair tie things. I usually add these as like little free gifts in all my Etsy orders. Um, but I have a huge bag down here full of faux. Faux elastic. That I'm just making these little things with. But you can wear them around your wrist. Or wear them as hair ties. Yeah. And then I have a bunch of little bows that I'll probably add as free gifts to my Etsy orders also. Yeah, I have thought about opening a shop on Amazon. Um, I don't know too much about it. There was another one. I can't remember what the other... Oh, I cannot remember the name of it. There was another one that I was actually considering opening up on. I might do Amazon, but I don't know. Somebody's messaging me. No, not Mercari. Man, I wish I could think of the name. I know once I'll end up thinking about it like later tonight when I'm in bed not doing anything. It was something. I can't remember. Now it's going to bother me. <laughs> so I only have three of these bows done. I still need to make seven more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. So I just... Hold on. How long does it take you to make the huge sparsely bows? Like which ones? Like the stacked bows? Or the ones that have like a lot of stuff on it? I don't really make those ones too much anymore. I make more simple, simple bows now. Messaging my brother. Oh, <laughs> how long does it take you to make the huge sparkly bows? Which ones? I'm not sure which ones. Have I made them before? Like the stacked ones. Those used to take me like maybe 10, 15 minutes to make. Not too long. I usually like cut all my material first and then go from there. Yeah, that's what I heard. 
about Amazon. There's that's what I'm saying. There's another one where the fees aren't that bad that other people rather use. There's two other ones actually that people rather use than Etsy. But like I said, I cannot for the life of me think of the names. And I know I'm pretty sure once I say it, everybody's gonna be like, oh yeah, like you'll see advertisements for it on um on Facebook, on Instagram, on YouTube, like they advertise everywhere and I can't think of the name right now. But like I said, it's not Wix. Because I think Wix is another place where you can go to sell stuff. A, a website maker or whatever. It's not GoDaddy. I tried that a long time ago. That was expensive. It's one where you like pay a monthly fee, which is not too bad. Oh, there's a knot. There we go. Yeah, Shopify is one, but Shopify is not the one that I'm thinking of. So I think Shopify is kind of expensive too. But yeah, Shopify is one of them. There was another one. Because I did, I did uh, get the Shopify app, and I signed up and everything, but there was another one that was cheaper than Shopify. Oh, hey, Danny. I didn't see who was messaging. What is it, baby? Guys, what should I have for dinner? I don't have anything really to cook. I haven't bought any meats or anything. Ooh, I need to change this girl's diaper. Hold on. Oh, <laughs> hi, Brian. <laughs> Brian is my brother. He's the one that I was talking about earlier, the one that we have the same mom and dad. He's my brother. <laughs> Subway. Uh, I wish I could have Subway right now. Maybe I will. I don't know. I have to save up for rent, though. So probably not smart to spend money right now. But I actually have stuff here besides the bread. But I do have stuff here to make sandwiches similar to Subway. So, I mean, that could... uh. Um, be good for now. Chipotle. I'm not a huge fan of Chipotle. I don't know. I, I didn't like the food at all. I tried it once and never again. Can I change you? Soup. Um, I actually have one can of uh, chicken noodle soup. I could make a video, which sounds really good right now. Fideo sounds really good. I actually might make fideo for dinner. I like it with chicken, though. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of uh, of uh, Chipotle. There's Jersey Mike's. Ooh, Jersey Mike's sounds really good. <laughs> we can't be friends. <laughs> Yeah, no. I wish I had a Panera Bread where I lived. I'd have to drive two hours to go to Panera Bread. I love Panera Bread. Do you have cheese and tomato soup? I had a can of tomato soup, and I would make grilled cheese, but I ate it. I ate the tomato soup. This was like a week ago. I need to buy some more. That's like one of my favorites. Especially when it's cold outside. I love making grilled cheese sandwiches with tomato soup. Yeah, I don't think there's a Jersey Mike's where I live either. I don't think. But yeah, Jersey Mike's is good. Grilled cheese sandwiches. Mm, yeah, grilled cheese sandwiches are really good. I do have... I just bought them too. But I like to save them for lunches. But I do have... 
Oh, that's my roommate. I do have, um, I just bought SpaghettiOs with the, the hot dogs, the little Franks. Because those are my favorite. I also got some with, um, meatballs, too. Ooh, sweet potato fries. That reminds me. The sweet potato fries. Oh, I'm going to cry. The sweet potato fries reminds me of the, the hospital in San Antonio um, that Ana e would stay at. Because she was in that hospital forever. At the beginning of 2018, she was there for six weeks. And then I think in the summer she was there for a few weeks. And then she was there for another six weeks. And then she got out for two weeks. And then she went back in. And then after I think about another two weeks, she ended up passing away. But they had the best sweet potato fries there at the hospital, the hospital cafeteria. I used to get the burgers and the sweet potato fries, and they were amazing. Maybe you could eat salmon, the fish. You so Brian, you said you ate all the pizza. I thought you said you ate all the pizza. Or did you leave leftovers? Yeah, Brian and I were talking last night about pizza. You're having frozen pizza? I have one in my freezer. I have a frozen pizza, but I like to buy the stuffed crust. Because that's my favorite. Oh, you had five? You had five pizzas? You guys got five pizzas? Can I change it? I'm going to change her diaper okay. because this girl stinks. What do you want? Okay. Please what? Yeah. Please, please what though? Yeah. You can't just say please and, and not say what you want. You gotta show me what you want, sweetie. There's nothing down there for you. All that stuff is mine. That's stuff that you shouldn't touch. That's your that's your drink, yeah. Oh, okay. What about dumplings? Oh, that sounds good too. We're over here talking about food. <laughs> well, when Danny went live the other day, she was talking about food and hers also. What was it that you, that, that, was it steak that you ate that night? Yes, uh, fideo, yeah. It's like a, it's like a Mexican soup. It's, um, yeah, I used to make it a lot, but I don't make it with, like, the little, because normally it's made with, like, little short noodles, like, they're, like, two inches long or so, but I like to make it with, um, like, the pasta shells or, like, you know, the macaroni and cheese shells. Um, I usually like to make, make it with those because it's easier for my kids to eat with those because when it's like the little short noodles it it's hard to eat it like that for kids at least <clears throat> steak and baked potatoes oh my gosh I remember you said when they were when they were baking the the potatoes you said it smelled like pizza <laughs> Kathy get up what are you doing what are you doing little girl you can't be touching my stuff let me change your diaper, guys. Give me one moment. Come here, Kathy. Let's change your diaper. Come on. Let's go change your diaper. Come on. Go that way. You want me to carry you? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Hold on, guys. Change your diaper. Come here. They might be able to see you if you want to get up. 
Let me wash my hands. Don't go to sleep up here. Don't go to sleep. Don't go to sleep. Oh. Yes, Archer. For what? Hold on, I'm still here. <laughs> what Why? Did what did you make? I made hide and seek, but with the bowling pins and the balls. My husband, I think we ate... Oh, you got a $50 gift card to Hobby Lobby? That's awesome. Yeah, I tend to end up spending hours in there, too. Hold on. Just checking right now, and there's one called Handmade Artists, Shopify, Squarespace. I think it's Squarespace, but they go by something else now. It's not, it's not called Squarespace anymore. It's something else. I think it used to be called Squarespace. Whenever I wash my hands, I have to put lotion. I cannot stand dry hands. I hate the feeling of dry hands. Yeah, I used to have a website um, on from GoDaddy. She just said it's changed to just square. It might be. Hold on. Oh, Weeblo. No, I haven't used Weeblo. Man, yeah, because there was a YouTuber. I have to find the video now. But there was a YouTuber I watched, and she uses something else. But I don't recognize any of those. Zibit, Artfire. I don't know. I have to check them all out and see. I thought I had... Hold on. Let me see. Come on. Yes, baby. Come on. Please. You want me to look at something really quick? No, I want you to find all of 
the bowling. The bowling pins? Yes. What do I get if Please. I find them? What do I get if I find them all? You get nothing, but you can also get my lion if you find all of them. I get your lion? Yes. Your what? prized lion? Wait, hold on, where is actually lion? I don't know, go look for it. Oh, I found it! I found it! <laughs> okay. Yay, I'm at 36 likes. Let's see if we can get to 40 likes. If you guys haven't liked the video, go ahead and like the video. Okay. How right. many likes? Right now it's at 36. 36. 39. 34. Let's see how many here. likes you have now. I just think these are so cute. I'm actually considering just saving... Saving a few for Pepe. Oh, it's too loud. Look, it's at the last. <laughs> because there's there's like a an auto or an audio bar here that goes up and down whenever there's sound. So that's what he's doing. How many likes now? Thirty seven. There's thirty seven likes. Archer, Danny says hi. Hey. <laughs> Say hi. Hey. Thank you, Lily. Lily says, you're so cute. <laughs> Kathy, don't go to sleep, baby. Ah, lion. Lion. I got your lion. You get it. I have all these. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven packages here that I need to get shipped off this week. And then I have those two tutus that are back there that I need to get shipped off. Plus, I'm also making the other, the rose petal tutu, the one with all the colors. Yes, Archer? He wants me to go look at something. Let me go look at something. Hold on, really quick. Because, like I said, he's very stubborn and he's not going to let up. Oh, I got two new favorites on my Etsy shop. Thank you, guys. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, let me go see what he wants. Really quickly. Oh, Kathy, do you want me to put something on for you? There's going to be no sound, though. Is that okay? Don't go to sleep. It's only 5 o'clock. Because if you go to sleep now, you're going to be up all night. Like you were last night. What do you want to watch? Which one? Do you want to watch uh, Rock Breaks the Internet? Yeah. Well, I'm going to yeah. put, put it on. Hold on, guys. Give me one minute. Ah! Oh, my gosh. My I do want to play with you, but no, right now, you don't. look, Archer, I'm talking to him right now. No, look. you don't. Look. look, let's see. This Lily says, hi, Archer. Adelaide says, hi, Archer. Or says, uh, hi, Cheryl, sorry. <laughs> hi, Cheryl. Look, they're all saying hi to you. Mom, it's no, been a while see since how you many likes time. do you have? 37. See? It's 37 likes. Oh, hold on. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, let me see. 
You've been watching my videos since Archer was a toddler? Aw, oh, thank you. All my pregnancy videos? Yeah. Yep. I did my pregnancy vlogs with Archer. Yeah, it's already 5 o'clock here. And I think Gatia is probably going to end up falling asleep. Yeah, so it's just growing super fast. If you guys have advice, I know I've watched a lot of YouTubers, um, but this is the mat that the silhouette came Mom. with. Yes, baby. But I've heard it's not that great of a mat, so if you have like recommendations. Here's your prize. Oh, thank you. Yes. This is his line. I got it at Hobby Lobby. It's so beat up. <laughs> I got it a while ago. A while back. But, yeah. I need to get one for Gatia because Gatia keeps taking it and um, they end up fighting over it. So I need to get one for her. They still have them at Hobby Lobby. And I'm probably going to like sew a little bow on her so that way she knows which one's hers. But that's Archer's Lion. Yeah, so if you guys have um, advice, I think somebody said that there's some on Amazon that are good, but I can't remember. But this is the one that the silhouette came with. And also the needles. The, sorry, the, yeah, the little needles that cut things. Let me know the best place to buy those, because I heard that the ones that come with the silhouette aren't that great either. So if you have advice, let me know. Yes, Lily, I do. I watch videos, old videos. Sometimes, like at night, I'll put them on the TV and we'll watch some old videos, especially with Anae in it. <laughs> yeah, there was, um, I was watching a YouTuber. I have to go look in my, in my history and see if I can find who it was that I was watching, but they. They gave advice on, and they had links to all the products in the description, but to all the better products out there. Not the Cricut mats and not the Silhouette mats, but there was another brand of mats that were really good to use. And then there's also like the needles too. There's some really good ones that are better than the ones that come with the machine or the ones that are made by that company. And yes, once I start getting used to making stuff with the silhouette, I will do tutorials as well. Because I know I'm probably going to get asked to make tutorials on the different things that I'm making. So I'll probably make tutorials on that stuff too. On the silhouette stuff too. It's over there banging again. Archer! Archer! Stop banging, please! Oh, yeah, I heard about the... Sp yes, I heard about the spray, too. Do I have Photoshop? No. No, I don't have Photoshop. That'd be nice. I would love to get Photoshop, but I don't have Photoshop. Oh, this is not working out. Hold on, I'm trying to get this to stay straight and it is not cooperating with me. <clears throat> Making another one of these, but it's close, like that's what, it, once it's made, that's what it looks like. So right now it starts out like this and then when you tie it, it looks like that. I had surgery on my foot to have a bone separated, and the surgery really helped. That's awesome. What, what kind of issues were you having with your foot?
Can you make PNG files in a computer? I don't think so. I've never tried. I need to ask my friend Tammy how she does it because she. I know she. I think she does. Um, Tammy used to be Tambos, I think, and I think she's like Tammy Creations or something. She's one of my <coughs> friends. Okay. I've known her. I've known her since I've had before. I think before I got pregnant with Archer, or maybe I was pregnant with Archer, but I had my. Um, when I first got my dog. What are you doing? Look! Oh. Well, you know they can hear you, right? I don't know. They can hear you. I know. They can hear you being silly. That is enough. That is enough. Okay? That is enough. Stop. Mom. Yes. Where's your Where's your tablet? Or do you want the Nintendo Switch? No. Wait, what happened to your tablet? Oh. What happened to your tablet? Does it need to be charged? No. Just come here for a second. Mom, well, I cannot move. Once I'm done, baby, I'll go, okay? No. Cannot move. Is your foot out from there? I'm gonna tickle your little foot. Oh no. No! <laughs> no! Archer's a dinosaur. <laughs> I create PNG files and then upload to the cutting machine. I find that it is easier creating files where I am comfortable than upload and cut. Oh, that's interesting. I need to look into that. I mean, I'm, I'm probably just going to like purchase files already made uh, for now. And then once I figure out how to like make them, then I'll probably make them as well. Oh, he's making your son laugh. <laughs> That's cute. How old is your son? Okay, make the other one. I'm just gonna glue them together. Like I said, normally it doesn't take me this long to make them, but I'm being a little distracted right now. Talking to you guys. Which I'm, I love. I love talking to you guys. 38 likes! Oh, he's, ah! I think you mentioned that before. Oh, You're <laughs> You're scared me! Yeah, I think, was it you that mentioned that before? You might have mentioned it before. The wind is nasty in California. Ooh. Is it like super windy over there? It's a little windy here today, but it's not too bad. It was, ah! it was raining today. Did that not scare you? It did actually scare me. It's being sneaky. It's being sneaky. <laughs> Archer, you scared them too. I'm sorry, Danny. I have very bad flat feet and tarsal. <laughs> You're scaring them. You scared Danny. <laughs> okay, Archer, no. Look at me. Look at me. Come here. That is enough, okay? No more. We can play later, okay? No. Hey, Archer thought... says he wants to make bows. You said you wanted to make bows, right? Yes. He wants to so learn how to, He wants to learn how to make bows, which makes me so happy. He wants to learn how to make bows. I kind of want to see what uh what he comes up with. His little ideas, they'd be super cute. I don't know what to try. I'm gonna try this. Yeah, I did it. Thank you. Oh no, 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 I have to do this idea. Hey, how old are you? Seven. Look at the eye. Oh, you poked it in the eye? Yep. Ooh. Creepy. 
Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, that's enough screaming, okay, baby? Look, you're scaring them. Look. See? She said, my son jumped so hard, almost knocked my tooth out. <gasps> Uh-oh. And then Danny said, that scared me. And <laughs> she started laughing. Okay, but no what, more screaming. What do I see? Right here. It says right there. Can you read it? That scared me. See? She wrote, that scared me. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, but no more, okay? We're not going to be screaming anymore. Oh, one said oof. <laughs> oof. Yeah. It's like a Roblox when you die. When they oof. die Roblox. <laughs> he, I have to start his homeschooling program. Um, I haven't started it yet. But yeah, he's going to be oh, homeschooled oh, 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 oh. this year. Oh. And then if schools open up again. Sh oh. If schools open up again oh. in August, I'll send him to school. But... Um, for right now, he's going to be homeschooled. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's supposed to be in first grade right now. Oh, thank you, April. Crystals, crafties. What? I'll have to check her out. Yes, baby. Um, um, let me take this wine back. You missed one. Now there's nine things left. I'm gonna give you a hint. It's in the kitchen somewhere. Oh, did you hide another one? Yes, sneaky, that's sneaky. the last one. Okay, well I'll go right now. I'll go look. I'm only gonna be on for a little bit longer, and then I'm gonna go. Great, because I gotta start making dinner. Let's see what we're gonna eat for dinner. With what I have, let's see what I'm going to make. I actually have egg rolls. Oh, I made it to 40 likes. Woo! Huh? I, made it, I made it to 40 likes. Oh. Yay! Thank you, guys. <laughs> if you guys haven't liked the video yet, go ahead and like it. And subscribe! And subscribe, yeah. I'm pretty sure they're all subscribing, but yes. If you guys haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe as well. And hit that bell. And, hit that. <laughs> and what else? Hit that bell. Like the video, subscribe, hit that bell. And what else, baby? No. No. No, you cannot have my pen. Because then you end up decorating my walls. And the bed sheets. And no, not the scissors. You can't have my ruler either. Mom. Yes. Um, what else? I don't know what I know. And leave a happy comment. Happy comment. And then what else? What else? Yes, yeah, send send me the like <gasps> send me the information. Because I know I'm gonna start the there is one program, I cannot what? pronounce it. Kyla, Ka, Kian, I can't, it starts with a K, I can't remember what it's called, but I was going to start that one. That's Mom, what my Mom, sister talk. recommended. And find the other, the last Because my sister homeschools all six of her kids. She's been homeschooling them since they started school. All six of them, she has six ah. kids. Keep boosting up your mom, are you aw? This girl loves to stand behind me when I'm working. It's, especially when I'm sewing, it is so convenient to have her pushing on my back. She's standing on the chair behind me. Well, the chair I'm sitting on, she's standing on it. There you go. Yes, that one. That's the one I'm going to start him on. I don't, I don't know how to pronounce it. Can Academy? Can Academy, maybe? But I'm still so confused by the website. I looked at all the stuff that he's supposed to be doing in first grade, and in all honesty, he learned all that stuff already in kindergarten and in pre-K. So, um, yeah, Brian. Go ahead and start having kids. I want more nieces and nephews. <laughs> Brian is my only sibling. 
No, I take that back. One of my other sisters doesn't have kids yet. But Brian is another one of my siblings that doesn't have kids yet. Oh my gosh, she's dumping all the donuts all over the bed. Ah, put them back. Put them back, please. So, come on, Brian. Get to work. <laughs> My youngest sister, not my sister Dallas, but one of my other sisters, um, doesn't have kids yet that I know of. I know my brother had one. My brother has, I think it's a girl. Don't come. I write it. And my other sister has two boys. My oldest sister has six. She has two boys and four girls. Eight. And then my other little sister has two girls. But then that means dealing with attachments. No. You don't. You can always adopt, or you can always go with a surrogate if you don't want to deal with. Or do you mean like attachment, like the kids? Or are you talking about like a woman? How many likes? It's forty. Now it's forty-two. Forty-two likes. Hey. Yes. Okay. Come on. I am doing this right now. You need to stop. I said I'll play with you later, remember? We have one more! I only a few more minutes. Come on, hurry! Okay, let me go look for this thing here. This is what I'm telling you about. He's very adamant about stuff. Hold on, guys. Pick up these donuts! Come on, pick them up! So I can put them away. Sorry guys. Did he already take your lion back? No. Here. Here. Okay, okay. if I take it straight. Oh, that's awesome that you adopted. Honestly, Brian, I think the Kids are better than I having a partner, in my opinion. I don't want, I'm not interested in having another partner. At least not at this time, at all. Uh, but I do want more kids, so. I'm looking at that in the near future. So, I do want more kids, but I don't want, I don't think I want another partner. Okay, Fox Panda, yeah, I'll go ahead and I'll check it out. I'll check it out today. This girl on her foot. Her foot. What are you doing? You're going to fall down. Beth, you're going to hurt yourself. Come here. Come here. Hold on. I put the scissors over here. Come here. Come here. Oh, you're my baby. I got a strike. I got a strike. I got a strike. You got a strike? Smacks me in the mouth. I'm trying to give you a kiss and you're getting a bucket in. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I ended up punching him in the mouth. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I'm gonna get kids, yeah. I got her. Not worth the added stress. Well, you know what? You can have my kids for a while. I mean, look at look at this. <laughs> I'm gonna get Kaya. <laughs> look at the love. Look at the love. <laughs> Okay, I think, I think, uh, Come here. between me and Sooner, uh, me and Brian's oldest sister, Katya, I think we've catch added me. enough kids. Because I am going to be adding more kids to my family, for sure. Whether it be through adoption or through other, Mom, other ways. Because I do want to have more kids. Oh, your cat. <laughs> okay, guys, that's enough. That's enough. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that will no. be an adventure. What, what are you talking about, Brian? Hi, Dominic. Dominic. She's loving on me. Love, 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 love. No, 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 no. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm probably going to be on just for a little no! bit longer. <laughs> I got to get these kids fed and then start getting them ready for bed. Because it's going to be... Well, it's 5.30. So I'll probably be on here for like another 20, 30 minutes. Ow! Ow, 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 ow. You're hurting me. No! Okay, Archer, Archer. Come here. I need to talk to you again. You need to calm down, that is enough. Okay, if you Wait, want to play. Are they scaring? Oh. Yes, you're scaring everybody again. So if you want to go play with Katya, go to the living room. No. Yeah, go, go get him, go get him. Go get him, go. No, no you don't want to go get him? Okay. Aw, that's so cute. Oh, Katya. <laughs> oh, thank you, Connie. It was good seeing you too. Oh, no. What's your name? M M Y. Oh, Mystic. M Mystic Two. What's your What's your name? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> the. <laughs> Wait. Wait. Okay, Danny. Wait. Archer, stop. More, My kids more. are. I'm probably gonna have to go because they're getting a little bit wild. Misty. Hi, Misty. Okay, Katya, let's get down. Can you get down? Can you get down? No, no. Yeah, so I'm probably gonna get off here in a minute because I need to feed my kids. So, bye, Danny. So I just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't given this video a thumbs yet, thumbs, oh my gosh, thumbs up yet, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. You can follow all my social media accounts in the description. They're all in the description down below. Ow. And, um, yeah, where's that bow? Here it is. And this is the bow that I was making more bows of here. So, yeah. Um, just waiting for... Like, my Etsy is also in the description down below if you want to look at my Etsy. Boop, boop, boop. Okay. And look, I have this picture here. A picture of Anai. I have it here. So, I always have it here with me. But thank you guys so much for joining. And I will be posting more videos and I will be going live more often. So, um, keep a lookout for that. But let me go ahead and go. She's not letting me put her down. Gatsy, I need you to get down so I can end the video. I need you to get down. Can you get down? Do you want to get on the bed? Get down. Go get Bubba's. Go get Archie. I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.